Hi friends, in this video we are discussing about an NPM package which I used in my React Native project. First I will tell what is the NPM package which I used in my project. React Native Google Sign-in Google Sign-in. In order to install and use this package I have to generate SHA1 and SHA256. SHA1, SHA256 for my project. So, in this video, I am going to explain how to generate SHA1 and SHA256 code of my React Native project. I have two options to generate this SHA1 and SHA256. First one is using key tool. Using key tool command utility, I can generate this SHA1 and SHA256. So, in order to generate this uh, SHA1 and SHA256 using key tool, I need key store file. So, you can generate key store file from Android Studio. Okay. So, using this key store file and this key tool command, you can generate SHA1 and SHA256. But in this video, we are going to discuss uh, how to generate these codes using this command gradle signing report i will show you let me copy this command and uh, i have opened my react native project in android studio so here uh, let us go to this terminal you see terminal below click on terminal you will get this uh, interface to execute the command i have just paste the let us paste the command and enter. Sorry, uh, I have to put a dot symbol. Dot gradually. Okay. Uh, let me enter. Look at here. It is generating um, uh, the the output. We can see the output here. For example, it will show something like this. Variant, config, store, alias, MD5, SHA1, and SHA256. So, by executing this command, this command dot forward slash gradu signing report, you will get this SHA1 and SHA256. We have another option using key tool and the key store files. Uh, in this video, I am explaining the second option. By running this command in Android Studio terminal window, you will get uh, output like this. It will have something like debug, config, debug, and store uh, location of uh, key store file. Here, you will get alias. And MD5 code, SHA1 code, SHA-256 code. So uh, please remember this command to generate uh, uh, the, the SHA1 and SHA-256 code for our React Native project. Using this key tool command, also we can do it. But I explain this command. Thank you.